Hey, it's Andy from SmartWP and welcome back to another video. Are you sick and tired of getting emails like this? The new user registration email is great if you have a small site and you wanna know when a new admin is added or something like that. But if you have a larger site that's constantly getting users added, you probably wanna disable these emails. So today I'm gonna to show you how to do that and let's dive right in. So I'm already logged into my example site here and we're gonna to go to the dashboard by clicking the top left here. And we're gonna add a new plugin. So let's go to plugins. We're gonna go to add new. And we're going to search manage email notifications. Now there's a lot of plugins to choose from here, but we can scroll down here and we're going to find the one that I actually am going to recommend. And that's this one with 90,000 installs. And let's install now. You can see it has the blue icon here. And we're going to activate the plugin. So once the plugin is activated, you'll have a new settings page. So if we go to settings, we can go to email notifications. And you can see here, this plugin actually lets you edit all of the WordPress emails and if they show up or not. So let's scroll down and we're actually gonna disable the new user notification to site admin. And we'll scroll down, hit save settings. And that's it, uh, using a plugin, it's obviously super simple, one click button basically. So if you're a beginner, of course using a plugin is probably the easiest way to disable this functionality. But if you're a more advanced WordPress user or developer, you probably just wanna add a uh, code snippet to your functions.php file or using the code snippets plugin. So the code snippet we're gonna use, you can actually get it on smartwp.com. This is our site here. You can scroll down, we just explained using the plugin here and now we're actually gonna go over using the code snippet. So I'm just gonna copy the code snippet here. And of course, if you know where to put this, like your functions.php in a child theme, you can go ahead and do that. But I'm just gonna show you how to do that with a code snippets plugin, just cause that's the easiest way to do it for the video sake. So now I'm back on our site and we'll go to snippets, add new, and we'll just paste in the snippet. And of course you're gonna wanna remove the double PHP uh, start tag there and we'll name our, and we'll name our snippet. And then we'll hit save changes and we can activate the snippet. And just like that, we've added a code snippet. Now what this snippet actually does is it removes the email that it sends the admin, but keeps the email that it sends the user about their new account, because you definitely want to keep those on the site. But of course, if you want to fully customize it, you can read uh, the actual code and modify it to your liking. I hope you found this video helpful. Remember to like and subscribe and check out more WordPress tips and tricks on smartwp.com. Thanks for watching. See ya.